Are you looking for a free and easy way to combine PDF documents? Well, I'm gonna show you how on this next episode. Hi everyone, Tim Brown. Welcome back to my Apple Podcast, the podcast that makes a personal connection to everything Apple. For this episode, I'm going to show you how you can combine PDF documents for free. That's right, for free. You have this ability on your Mac. I know a lot of times when we're looking to accomplish things, the first thing we think of is there's got to be an app for that. And usually you wind up having to spend some kind of money. Well, in this case, you don't because you can use an application that comes with your Mac called Automator. Automator allows you to set up a range of workflows to get things done. And one thing you can do with Automator is combine PDFs. So let me walk you through the process. Okay, let me pull up my desktop here. And as you can see, I have a finder window open and I have two PDF documents. They're both related to museum education. Uh, one's basics of VTS, or visual thinking strategies, and another one has to do with a guide to museum visits. I wanna combine both of those documents into one. Well, an application that you can use to do that is Automator. And you probably have never noticed it on your, your Mac before. If you want to find it real quick, use Spotlight in the top right corner of your Mac. And just type in Automator, A-U-T-O-M-A-T-O-R. And then you'll see under Applications, Automator. Just click on it and wait for it to open. When it opens, you'll see a range of options, workflow, application, service, folder action, print plugin, and so forth. You just wanna choose workflow. So you essentially wanna start a new workflow. Okay, next you wanna just go ahead and pull up that finder window with your documents. And just drag both of those documents to the workflow stage. So I'm going to start with the basics of ETS first. And what you see here is that a menu item has been dragged to the workflow stage. And instead of dragging a separate module, you're going to actually take the second document and then drag it right inside that module so that the document is listed in list view underneath the first one. That's the first step. Okay. Now what you want to do is go on the left-hand column and you want to look for PDFs and then in the next column adjacent to it, look for combined PDFs or PDF pages and take it and drag it underneath the first module that says get specified finder items. So you have get specified finder items as the first module and then underneath that combined PDF pages. You're then going to have combined documents by and two options, appending pages and shuffling pages. Just leave appending pages selected. That's usually the default setting. And you have one more thing to do. Go back to the left column and choose files and folders. And then you want to look for open finder items and then drag that underneath combined PDF pages. So you now have three modules stacked on top of each other and you're ready to go. The next thing you have to do is just click run in the top right corner and then wait for Automator to combine the documents and it will open up in your default application. So in this case, preview. And you can see here, here's the basics of ETS at a glance and then underneath that guide to museum visits. So now both documents have been combined and now all I have to do is hit file and save the final document to wherever I, I wanna save it to. And there you go, that's my quick tip for today. Thank you for tuning in once again to My Apple Podcast. You can of course check me out at myapplepodcast.com. I'm also on Facebook and Twitter.